Hi, it's Rosemary Bradison, the Scientific Mystic, here with your little inspirational video for the newsletter this week. And let's talk about your thoughts and the energy of your thoughts. You know, I can see, <clears throat> sometimes I can see energy around people or around thoughts. And what I see can often be an energetic column being built by the thoughts that get energized by someone. And it's, it's just like, you know, in brain science, they're saying that when there's a neural pathway that is connected by your thought, you can reinforce that neural pathway by thinking the same thought over and over again. Well, when you energize and create the energy of a thought, by thinking it over and over again, you build a column of real magnetic energy from what you're thinking. So if you keep thinking negative thoughts, if you're thinking things that are about uh, angry thoughts or about upsetments in your life or worry in your life, you create this huge magnet of energy that attracts what that is. You know, there's a story and a theory from spiritual politics that when there was a hate campaign in a certain city, the tornado that came a week later and struck the very building where these people gathered to fuel their hatred was actually a tornado attracted by the energy of the vortex of their thoughts and the energy of their thoughts. So I want you to really be aware that your thoughts are magnets of energy. So you have control over your thoughts. You can shift what you're thinking. And neuroscience is saying, if you don't reinforce this neural pathway, the connections in your brain by not thinking a thought, it'll start to dissipate. So you reinforce the thoughts you want to have and that neural pathway gets reinforced in your brain. And if you avoid thinking or stop a thought that you don't want to think, you can actually diminish that neural pathway in your brain. So thinking about it from the science point and then take it into the energy point. What kind of a magnet do you want to create? How energetic do you want that magnet to be? So think the thoughts about what you do want in 2013. Think about what you want to manifest in 2013 and keep thinking it. Write it up, create pictures and put them in front of you so that you're reinforcing that pathway in your brain. You're reinforcing the message in your unconscious mind about what you want to pursue. And you're energizing this column of magnetic energy by thinking the thoughts of what you want to attract. So take control of your thoughts and make 2013 the year of your dreams by thinking about your dreams. And any way I can help you, please let me do that. This is Rosemary Bradison at thescientificmystic.com, and I look forward to seeing you next time. Bye now.